disgust. And when I watched the video of him doing it, just got angry more and more every time I saw that. On Thursday, around 11 o'clock at night, a group of at least two individuals broke into my jewelers in Henderson, taking thousands of dollars worth of items. In surveillance video provided by George Tyler, owner of the jewelry store, you can see a black pickup truck parking right in front of the store. A suspect begins to work on opening the front door, then grabs a garbage can out of the pickup truck, takes it inside, and begins burglarizing the store. Let's go. I know. A second suspect joined soon after, ransacking through the business. Came, they just went through everything that was left out. They took all of our watches in that case, and, you know, and we had all of our silver stuff here. They kind of cleaned us out. They took my cash drawer. It only had change in it. Neighboring business owner Debbie Agayo of Liberty Tax says the news of the burglary doesn't surprise her as this type of crime has happened in the area before. But her worry is that it's only going to get worse. Well, I'm concerned, especially with the recession and inflation and all the problems we're facing right now. Most of us do close early for that reason. Um, the latest I'm ever open is 7 or 8 o'clock at night. Tyler says dealing with the crime's aftermath has been a struggle not just for him but his employees as well, especially at this time of the year. Right before Christmas, it kind of gets our spirits down. You want to we want to be able to help our community get what they need for Christmas gifts. But now he's warning other businesses to stay vigilant at all times. Yeah, you don't know. You know, you think they're coming in. You don't know if you're being cased. You don't know if they're checking you out, seeing how many staff members, see where everything is at. Just be on your guard, be alert.